Hello and welcome. This is what I call my uh, generic hello for those sessions where I've uh, had to had a splice to a video. So this is, I don't like you to just wander in and see a bit where it's been spliced without me saying hello and welcome. So yes, please enjoy the content. Just want course play. Ooh, why? Oh, it's because I've picked that one, you wall in. It's got a, a front bucket. Yes, and that's how you do it. I read, I literally did. No, why will it not let me? Why can I not change vehicles now? Right, now let's try that. Yes, you do indeed um, use, for silo work, you can, and I, I read up on this literally two days ago, so I do know how to do that now. Yeah, so I might be sort of showing that in the future but I need to I need to get my own head around it as well as you, you can't teach others because you're going to teach someone wrongly if you do it right I'm not sure threes gonna be oh no it is it's bigger than you think all right smashing create new folder cow field save course activate 5.1 meters. I hope I remember that that's the that's how big that is because to me it's a 5.5 right it's smashing and I'm wasting I know I keep saying about using the right tractor and I'm using the biggie for that ridiculous right anyway we need to be going to the shop we would really appreciate a lorry uh -huh. there's a lorry brilliant uh, did we yes we did we put the slurry into there how are the animals doing at the top and i know we need some wheat grabbing for the chickens before we move on or we're going to have poorly birds but uh, duck it ducks actually yeah <laughs> i was just to get in my head thinking no no, no they are, they're not chickens not on this let's play we've gone for the very first time for ducks and we have yeah what oh it's gone down quite a bit actually even in that hour now the food for those is fine we need to move the wall at some point quickly all right so then let's pop over to the shop and we need some chicken food now we do also need a proper trailer which is there You know, forget. I keep forgetting that I've got the fence. I keep. It's not in my thing. I've, I've, I've caught up with the John D. And knowing we've got that, and I know we've got the uh, New Holland as well. So yeah, on this let's play, we're doing well for big tractors. Now this is the one thing on the hills of Tuscany that uh, yeah, it's it's weird. And I ha I've, on the last episode, I think I was all the the last couple of episodes. I did realise, yeah, I sort of made the um, comparison between that and... Now, be careful. And... Oh, words. Words are failing me again. It's getting to the back end of the week again. And I, yeah, oh, oh we had a bit of a tussle then between the cars on the map. That doesn't happen very often, but it does happen sometimes. Yeah, on... Um, Oh, it nearly popped then. I nearly had it in my uh, grasp and it's disappeared again. Westridge Hills is what I'm talking about. Yeah, Westridge Hills, one of my favourite American maps. Oh, nearly get away with it now, nearly. Yeah, on Westridge Hills, that was, well, the fields that we'd got, and especially the fields that were actually the ones. Whoa. Thank you, car, for disobeying the natural laws on the road, you absolute maniac. <laughs> Seriously. Right, okay then. So actually, we will we can actually do this ourselves, can't we? No, it's that one. I always forget and always do the wrong one. Right, let's stick these on. Uh, it's always... This is the only bad thing. Now, obviously, in real life, you'd reverse these on, which is obvious, because you've got... Yeah, you, you can't really go up the top and then drop off, but unfortunately, <laughs> in Simulator, that's sometimes exactly what... Ooh. Now, we can do this. We can do this. But let's, let's do the one we can do easily first. 
Okay, that's a three, two points, I think, by the look of it. So let's have a go. Otherwise, we'll side lift it. We could probably just about get away with using the chafer. Now, how am I supposed to reverse now? You've left me no room. You've stolen my room. And you're an immovable object. Thanks, Giants. <laughs> Thanks a lot. Oh, you know. Okay. Well, we're going the other way then. You've totally, totally stuffed up my uh, angles and the lot. Right, let's, let's try that, like, in the car park. It's a horrible angle, but we, uh, with a little bit of shuffling around, we'll manage it, I think. Yeah, uh, I think these were good ramps as well. They were not yeah, they didn't do weird things. This is this is one reason why I love this trailer. It is got. Uh, I think the, my favourite trailer of all is the H2 Studios, the 50 footer that we've got here. And I didn't realise this is only a little bit bigger than that actually. So going forwards, I probably will. But then it's nice to have not just it's always the same one, isn't it? Really. So let's stick this right back because even that little difference can make make the difference between having one or two implements big implements like this on right, so we, yeah we are making a bit of a yeah and I don't think the straps are proper up there but if we leave it half and half then the straps will get the front end now then uh, and this time in a way we are going to be going forwards yeah because that is a proper three-point link on the front yeah, I'm looking forward to doing this. I sort of did. I've used this in the other configuration, but I've not used it in this fully automatic one. So I'm looking forward to using this, where you literally sit in the. Because even on the other one, you can actually get in it. But obviously, because it's not the fully autonomous one like this is, you can't really do what you can do with this one, which I presume is literally to drive inside it. So no 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 you you get you yeah you're getting this a bit confused. We need to be pushing it quite severely to get the angle right. Oh, it's well actually because that's lifting that that's, that didn't do a bad job. Well. When I say not a bad job, it has fallen off in, in on this side a little. Will that make a difference? Not if we clamp it down quickly. No, I'm, I think we'll be, yeah, it's a little bit, but then again, that's. Be, I wouldn't do that in real life. I will add that. I mean, I know I'm always going on about realism, but it's quite difficult. It doesn't actually do what it would do in real life, so I'm trying to get this as good as possible. Like, you know, I think I could go. No, yeah, that's excuses. It is. I could have done a better job than that. I really could. Definitely. Right. Let's go out. And, yeah, we need to... We need to probably book this. Yeah, that seems to be a, a new thing as well that you can only like fill from. Uh, yeah, just the last second I got that warning from that instinct that says you can hit the sign, and lo and behold, I did. <laughs> right, smashing. So then, yeah, I'm looking forward to jumping in this. Yes, there's not an awful lot now that you can actually load from the fill points in the cedars and planters, which, yeah, to be honest, I don't mind. I'm, yeah, I don't mind doing the uh, load and unload, although I tend to have gone for that lovely point that we've got, which is fillable from a trailer, and we do need to get that sugar beets done as well. Ooh. Immovable objects, immovable objects. Right, so then we want to be grabbing that off first. And we're going to park it not far in case, in case we're looking. There is still the odd one that you can, but I don't know whether, again, this is something that you, you make these statements and obviously giants change things. So it is possible that actually it doesn't. Now then, let's go and see. Look to me, it looks like the stone thing is just sitting on the field like he did on the last one and, and I didn't notice it for about 
10 minutes. I know she has done some. I knew that tree was going to get in the way. <laughs> I just knew it. <laughs> just I tried to spare it, and, and that's what it does to me. Do you know? Well, she, actually, she's done almost all of it, so do you know? We'll just finish this off. There's only this strip in the middle. She did a cracking job. Oh, and then this is that bit there, but yeah, not bad. It did most of it. It was only the inner bit, so really what I should have done was... No, I don't think I'd have got away with another headland. No, I think that was it. So if nothing else on this session... Actually, yeah, that is true. This is a linked session, so really I would probably about done a complete session. So I might, thinking about that, actually... I think no, I've only seen one. Yeah, I think one, one more. I don't. Yeah, I do like to do events, but then sometimes it can get way more than an hour and a quarter, an hour and a half, and that's when I think oh, that, that's that's a little bit big. But one thing I am trying to do is to get pay more attention to the auto save whilst I've got that on, because you can sort of count the auto saves and realise that's an hour long session and, and that's what I'm trying to get better at to count the auto saves in my head not always that easy when you're busy doing everything else you can sometimes think is that one, is that two, is it three uh, but yeah it isn't a bad way of keeping track, keeping count right, I believe that is that let's get this emptied These, it wasn't a lot but it was more about damaging the equipment no, it was no. If I'm honest, it was more about making the line that I was thinking. I thought it was, yeah, it was quite nice that we are. We've got a process that we can follow from start to finish and make, yeah, make oh, good with it. Gordon Bennett. I need a crash counter today. Anyway. <laughs> Right, so then it should be able to jump in there. Uh, I would say it's where the that is there. Now where I've got in this. I got in the this is the autonomous one, so you really should be able to get in this one. Okay, let's Oh, is it this side? Uh, I thought this was supposed to be autonomous. The other, I mean, I have used the other one, and you can actually get inside it. This is the pro supposed to be the. I did. Did I order? Did I order the right one? Let's let's before we start chuntering and. Automated. It is the automated one. So, do, what does that mean? <laughs> I thought because the other one you can actually get in and look out the windows. I'm sure you can. I'm sure I'm not imagining it. I'm sure I remember doing that and thinking, "Ooh, well, if this is the uh, semi-automatic, then I was thinking the automatic one should really, yeah, you should be able to jump in it." And so perhaps it was me getting carried away. Perhaps you still need a tractor. It looks like it. So not as automated as I'm thinking. Right, anyway, let's grab it off. That we can do. And see if it'll fill naturally. Uh, obviously, I could have bought the sugar cane, which would have been a... a yeah. Actually, because this does absolutely cane seeds. Ha, ha, ha. <laughs> oh, okay. So you're not going to not gonna play nicely for me. Okay, well... I did leave you at a weird angle. I, I do definitely agree. We're going to have to do something creative now. And we're going to have to reverse off because you're sort of like on half and half. Yeah. And it's not allowing me to do anything. We're going to have to like sort of trick it. Oh, uh, I would say that could be the fact that it's probably strapped down that's causing you issues. Actually, no, it's not, but there is a strap on. Yeah. And I did unstrap it, so I don't know what that was about. I must have caught it. These things don't happen without my intervention. So then, let's see. 
Yeah, now the fertiliser shed's just over there, and can we... F Ooh, maybe we can. Oh, no, we can fill with fertiliser. No, it will not let me fill with... So do we... Because it is a, it's a nice trick, that is. I, I was missing a trick, really, doing that. So, yeah, I would go back, but we've just been up to the shop, so for once... We're going to allow it. We're going to have some delivered, some of the sugar. Oh, wow. My favourite. Absolutely, yes. No thought involved in that. Oh, yeah. <laughs> just, just, yeah, I'm trying to trying to get some seeds here. Oh, do you know, sometimes the, the inner child just takes control. It does when you see things like that and you've got the money. And very rarely do I have the cash to do that. So we are looking for pallets, I believe. We're going to buy some. And we're going to be very liberal with the uh, sugar cane because it is super duper price for 2,000 litres. Uh, yeah, although the seeds we can buy... Oh, uh, no, they're still cheaper. Yeah, you can almost get three of these, really. Oh, so, yeah, almost. Yeah, it's a little bit over. One... Two, three, four, five. I think that is a, a complete fill on that, if I remember rightly. I think it's a thousand. I think it's a biggie, this one. I, th I think I'm right. I'm not being greedy. In fact, why not use that very vehicle? Yeah, because this is the lead. It's even, it's still not eclipsed by that beautiful fence not really they've got two I've got two of these ah I had another let's play where I did that as well when I got two of these and I was forever getting confused between which was the 400 and odd horsepower and which one was the <laughs> the big one and that was funny enough Westbridge Hills yes I did I had the fortune to have two of these like we have on this so I'm well chuffed with that that is, that is my favourite tractor. It is. Yeah, I, do, I really do wish it was like FS19 that I could stick a front three-point link on it. Because I do, I, I've got to be honest, I, it, 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 I'm almost tempted to... It's ju it's steering those phenomenal. That, the way it glides on those is just so phenomenal. I love it. It is amazing. So to have two of them, yeah... Is brilliant, but I do really, yeah, I'm almost tempted to say this is my second favourite now, really. In fact, no, I, I think I will. The tractor we have now, the class, the class, the case, <laughs> the case even, I've got to say, I think that this has eclipsed this, also for usefulness, yeah, I can't really, I can't really sort of ignore that fact that, oh my life, why did you stop? Uh, why can I now all of a sudden not fill from the box when I could refill from the box a minute ago? What's that about? Uh. What on earth is that about? No, I had trouble with this before last time, didn't I? I think this is this was the start, I think, of where I reckon Giants had made the change, and I just don't think I've actually got used to it yet. Because it is. I, I think, thinking back, it's weird how sometimes it takes a bit of time for you to uh, adjust. I'm almost sure that everything now needs, like, dropping in or... Yeah. All right, let's switch that off. We don't need that. Right, so we're going to need a... going to need you, aren't we, in the Samurai? also need the pass-through weight no it's not on there we've got the little weight but that's not going to be that much use really no it's not quite right it is no need yeah nearly a ton I think it's 900 kilograms I think uh, it's not sure that's going to be enough now then if I remember rightly no, no, actually it's got the AGM. If you remember, we struggled. We could not get this to work on the other tractor, which, thinking about it now, is actually quite useful. Um, we, 
Oh my life, what's happened to that? Please don't tell me we've had a mod crash and it's reset and gone off the map or something silly. Because we did, we did try to use it for the other New Holland. And it was definitely a, around here somewhere. Oh. Ah, I see it, I do. It's further down actually, Mr. Smith. It's not gone and crashed and burned at all. It's just you, you're in the wrong place. Now then, let's try and gauge this right. Although it's not going to do the shuffle that it was doing for the... Yeah, it really did not like that. Right, so I want to grab the Samurai, which in my... At least I know where the Samurai is because we... Yeah, I've just seen it as we were doing this. Right, fantastic. Brilliant. Now then, what with it? Now this is a heavy tractor. If, yeah, including the ballast, it's now 14.9. So that's not bad. So if we, no, this is going to double handle the day, how it is what it is. So is it? Ah. So it goes in the. Oh, that is a point. Do it. Oh no. It's two tons, so we can almost do. Two. I was going to say, will it? That is interesting. Will it burst the boxes? No. See, a giant's box doesn't burst. Now then, let's just see. Does it say refill if you do that? No, it really does need us to completely chuck it in. Right, no worries. Apologies for the fact that I'm trampling the. Now then, I should just about be able to do it, but yeah, I probably would have been better to do it the other way. I'm sure this is either 10 or 12 tons in this beast. Yeah, the last time I used it, of course, was on Ohio Richlands. Brilliant, okay, so let's do that again until we haven't got no more left or it's full which I don't think I'm going to fill it I think actually there's more even than that I do love these yeah so you can't burst a giant's bag it's just those special multi-crop greenhouse bags the, tw the eight tonners that seem to burst right okay Yes, I, I would like on this Let's Play to make up for the Ohio Richlands disaster. Ah, it expands. Oh, wow. That's what the automated bit is, because I think on the other one, that's actually just extended all the time. So, that, is that it? Is that, what, is that what the automated is on about? It's just that it goes backwards by itself. Oh, my life. I don't know. Right. But I, I think we're an awful long way off filling that. An awful long way. I don't think we're even. Yeah, we're not. Although it depends because if it if it doesn't go full full, if it just goes to the back because it is expanding, then yeah. But we are gonna make the most of this because to be honest, that's a quite a large sugarcane field. So and it does really cane the fields. I know. I apologise. I, I, it's it's, but it is true. But it does seem to be coming higher as well, so I don't know. Right, let's order some more. Yeah. Pallets. So, being an artist, that's about half full. So, we. Wow. Really? One, two, three, four, five. Right, okay, let's try that again then. Oh, yeah, let's get the ones. Oh, no, let's not pull that over. And let's redo that. What did you do on today's session? Oh, I filled the sugar game. It took the entire session. <laughs> Hopefully not. Yeah, I would uh, have to cut that out or make the session a little longer to make it a little bit more interesting. Right, let's... Seriously? Yeah, today must be my clumsy day. It really has got to be. I 
has got some tonnage in it, but I think I reckon we're getting close. Yeah, it's sort of doing both. It's going backwards and it's uh, so I, I think it's about 20 tons, which means we should literally do this because that is exactly how much we've ordered. I thought it was 10 tons, but I think I'm out. I think it was double that. So that's it. So now it's a matter of filling. Oh no, it's still going back as well. Which I think, no, no, there's still a bit of room as well. But I think we, it seems to be getting full now. So I'm not sure. Well, we'll have a look in a minute. We're going to jump in the fan and see. Because I thought it was 20 tonnes. Please don't tell me it's 30 tonnes. Gordon Benny. That should be about right then, surely. I'm sure I've ordered 10 in total. Two lots of five. I'm sure I didn't. Oh, no, we, were, we've, we obviously miscounted one time because we're one short. Yeah, we're uh, 1.5 tonnes short, so. So let's rectify that. We'll buy one more and we'll have a little bit left. five tons we'll have 500 liters left in there and I'm quite sure we're gonna to need to order some more anyway because yeah my, my master plan is to um, keep some seeds back but I'm not sure that we're gonna have any I don't know uh, did, trying to think about how big the field was we did use a lot but I'm not sure we might actually have a bit left So we should have 500 litres. Oh, okay. Is my mathematics that poor? I'm sure I. Uh, that's the lorry. I was going to say, I can't see. <laughs> I can't see any seeds. I can't because you're not the right one. Oh, hang on a minute. Oh, I was going to say that that can't have gone in because. How did I miss that? It looked like it was going in and everything. Right, okay, let's fix this. That's better. Right, let's try that again. Two tons. Should be about right. Yeah, it's definitely going in. I can see the level. Right, okay. So is that is that all done? Let's have a look. Please tell me, I, I yeah. Do you know? Also, actually, it's bigger than two. Yeah. So my count, my my uh, maths was okay, apart from the fact that I tipped some out. But actually, it, it's more than that. It's like twenty-two thousand or something like that, by the look of it. Right. Yeah. Now this would be the last job of the day because this is going to get be a bit of a monster session without a shadow of a doubt. So this is the job. In fact, you know, because it is. We're going to do this ourselves. Yeah. So I am going to say my words. I'm going to see you guys and gals on the other side.
there we were, dawn. Absolutely spot on time with the auto save. Yeah, so that's another 15 minute segment. Right, so we did have a bit of a uh, spare. Now, can we? I think we can. I'm almost sure I didn't. Isn't it those lovely. Oh, I do like those new ones. Oh, caught oh, cool. a first fertilizer. Yeah, I really do like those uh, black sort of thing is. I think they're amazing. Yeah. Right, so then. We have done our field. We just need to lime it now. We've got quite a lot of lime. We've got the chickens to feed as well. I, I'm really tempted to do them, but I'm not going to. No, we, it's been a monster session again because, yeah, what, what it is. We, we're coming on a pace, though. When you consider what we've done, we'll have a bit of a recap. Just hoping my alarm doesn't go off because I know it's uh, imminent. Yeah, we've got field 16 left to do. Oh no, I've got nine minutes before my alarm goes off. Yeah, we've got 19 and 21 looking quite green. 18 and 20 only just been planted, as has our little unnumbered field that we've got down there. We've got that to plant. We did sunflowers. Ah, that's right. I think we're going to do oats in both because that, that makes a fairly reasonable size field. So next session we're going to do that. Feed the... Um, feed the chickens and all the rest of it. Um, I still can't believe we're at four hundred seventy thousand dollars, and we bought this beautiful tractor. I do think we're about there, though. Yeah, I really do. I, I mean, we have got a lot of tractors now. Let's have a quick look at how many tractors we have got. Yeah, because I know we've got. I know we've got that little car as well. We've got a, a sugar beet harvester. I do think we could do with one, two, three, four five large tractors and we have some medium i believe or is it all small now i know we have got one medium i think no two ah that is classed as a medium okay so i would class that as a large because of its horsepower but yeah that's uh oh i didn't realize that was a 325 horsepower i must have done when i bought it i thought it was 200 and something fantastic so we did upgrade it brilliant that's and some smalls. One, two, three, four small tractors. So I would say we're about there, even on a big farm. I think that uh, your spending spree is over where tractors are concerned. I think we're completely done. Yes, yeah, so the next session we'll get those two fields done. Uh, yeah, I really wish I could get rid of the couple that are a bit troublesome, but it is what it is. Yes. Anyway, all that is left to be said for this particular session is thank you very much for watching truly do hope that you stick with me on this journey as always i do invite your comments yes it's uh i am thoroughly enjoying my time on here now and actually the last two sessions were no do not take providence as my grandma would say it's true we have uh, had nice sessions the last two sessions but i suppose it is such is life that uh, sometimes yeah so just ph value is okay oh okay well that's okay we will we will sort that out oh let's see it's, it's making its mind up yeah i think we got all the little tiny bits i was trying to be as thorough as possible because there's some horrible bits yeah like that tiny weeny bit i think we'll get no no i don't think that is that's just yeah there were the odd little patches I hadn't done and I think I've actually rectified them now anyway yes I am going to say goodbye for now <laughs>